Hey everybody, it's me, Megan here at Fit Life, coming to talk to you today about constantly thinking about food. And in an article in the November 2016 Women's Health Magazine, under mental health, uh, Stephanie Zerwas, who has a PhD, uh, she's a, about a psychologist and clinical director for uh, the University of North Carolina Center of Excellence for Eating Disorders, I want to make sure I proper, properly know her, she helped with this topic. And it's so true that we constantly think about food. I mean, special occasions, daily occasions, are surrounded by food because we have to have it, right? And between everything we see on TV, everything we see in magazines, just everywhere there is food. And so there's a fine line between, okay, am I always thinking about food? Or, you know, at, or is this normal? And the person asks, like, do I have an eating disorder? Because all I do is think about food. And, you know, the final thought was basically that if eating healthy and micromanaging meal prep is taking over your life, like you skip events that won't have your safe foods there, then maybe you do need to talk to a professional. And the National Eating Disorder Association, you know, has resources. But I think for many of us, this is a real, real issue because food is always around us. We have to have it. Unlike other aspects in our life that we can eliminate when, you know, all these choices are confronting us, food is a choice we have to make constantly. But remember that you still have to live life and life doesn't stop on your fitness journey because you're trying to lose weight or attain your goals. Make it work for you and make realistic lifestyle changes that are sustainable. And I'm here to help you and keep you accountable and motivated throughout the way. Have a great day. Thank you.